morning. Welcome to another week of vlogging. I'm with Paige. Do you want to start with me? Hi guys, I'm from pagejoanna.co.uk but you can also find me on YouTube by searching Paige Joanna or there'll be a link in the description box below. Instagram, phone number, oh, address. Instagram is Paige Joanna with two A's because Paige Joanna was taken so uh, feel free to <laughs> check that out. So that's where to find Paige. Did you say address? I was joking because you were giving out like every contact detail. My PO box. <laughs> My PO box is. <laughs> no! Fucking hell! <laughs> so we're in London, we've been sat talking for about an hour now, but we probably should get up and do something. We're going to shoot some stuff, have some food, probably forget to shoot some stuff, but we'll see what happens. Um, yeah, we've got, well I've actually got two outfits and so have I. Jess has got, have you got two? I've got two and then a jumper, just in case I want to go. So two outfits and some extras. Yeah. <sighs> just taking pictures of my bum. <laughs> Didn't want the umbrella in the shop, so I ditched it on the stairs. Ha! We've just done outfit one in this really cool location. So we're gonna go get some food now, and then I think we're gonna get the second outfit done and maybe some like lifestyle shots and stuff. I would show you Paige in the same clip, but it's really uh, difficult because we're under <laughs> umbrellas. So you can kind of do it like this. <laughs> it's kind of hard to get our heads in together because it's yeah, raining. Yeah, it's really difficult. But yeah, so far so good. They're looking good. They're girl. looking really good. We've been really artsy, I think. Yeah. I mean, I'm not the best photographer, but we <laughs> I tried. Feel like I've done well, guys. <laughs> You've done well. <laughs> Mine are questionable. Mine are very uh, usable. No, I'm joking. They're good. <laughs> Mine are usable. <laughs> no, we can do more. I said we'll do more. Yeah, but I'm not that fast. My outfits aren't that cool, to be fair. It's all about this girl today. <laughs> right, let's go get some mood. food. pages because we needed to grab um we needed to grab our bags again i managed to spill let me use it this up i managed to spill an egg yolk i sort of like poked the poached egg and it just squirted all over me on my white jumper which i'd show you but i put it in a carry bag it was on my instagram stories but yeah whoops so lol it was quite funny i googled how to get rid of it so that was fun but we're gonna take a selfie and then we're gonna head back off because that's what we're doing Woo! this vlog is so boring already No, it's Monday. Oof. Um, it is about one o'clock. My hair looked very nice until I got soaked because I forgot my umbrella. <laughs> but we're at the train station. I am heading into London for a um, event with Pandora for their new birthstone collection, which I will try and get some snaps of. But obviously, I'm not as good at silkies as Adrian, so can't promise very much. Um, I've actually been to the gym at seven o'clock this morning. Came home, got back into bed, and then we just had a really relaxed morning, just getting ready and stuff. And now I look like this. I'm very annoyed with my hair, it was really nice and now it just looks a bit, I don't really know what it looks like to be honest. And here's Adrian. Just got up, something's wrong, I waited up with wounds on my feet, where will you be? Flickering through memories, the polaroids yellowed in the sun, longing to be seen. Come and 
do this a lot. <laughs> we're never out of bed when we're in together. We've had cups of tea and um, I've been showing Shah the <coughs> Capture Your Style book, which is really good. Um, I had the Pandora event earlier. Didn't really get much vlog, but I did a lot of Insta story, so I'll try and put some of that in if I can. Um, and then I saw my friend Sam, who I used to work with. I'll link him down below. So we went for coffee and a catch up, and now I'm here with Shah. Yay. And it is about nine o'clock, I think. Maybe a bit later. Half nine. Half nine. And we're tired. And I have and no makeup on, so you're really mean putting me in your vlog with no makeup on. <laughs> <laughs> just be a grudge for a bit. Okay, mm. bye. We just bought a new camera lens, which is really naughty. We should be saving for travelling, but we bought the camera a 50 lens mil. Is for um, we bought a 50 mil because we just bought a 50 mil because basically we needed a new lens. We're using the 45 with the Olympus at the moment, but we wanted to be able to use the Canon today for the shoot. So we've run into town to do that. We've got to take some stuff back to Primark quickly. I don't think I've mentioned actually who the shoot's for, so I will discuss later. Just got home, so we're having some soup before we head to the exciting shoot that I've been talking about. And we've just picked up the Canon 50mm lens, which is the 1.4. Um, literally obsessed. I've wanted this lens for as long as I've been blogging, so this is like my little splurge that I'm really glad I've got, and it feels so good to know that I kind of paid for it myself, and that my blog paid for it kind of thing. Don't know, but um, I thought I'd mention now what the shoot is. So basically, you might remember that a couple of weeks ago, I think it was in last week's vlog actually, I got some pieces from Jack Wills, and then I also got some the other day as well, which I showed you. So the Jack Wills event last week and all the stuff is basically because I'm doing quite a big collaboration with them at the moment for their new sporting goods range, which I will link down below because it's honestly incredible. I'm so obsessed with that, and I'm not just saying this because it's a paid sponsorship or anything, but it genuinely is one of the best sporting ranges I've ever worn. I prefer it to some really high-end like sports brands. So that's kind of an indication of how much it's actually really good. And the bras are really supportive, the leggings are really great and all that kind of jazz, but there will be a post on it tomorrow, which I'll leave linked down below so you can find out more about it. Cause I'm gonna go into detail about like the fits and stuff like that. But um, yeah, I'm doing a video for them today at Block in London, which is a gym that does classes and stuff, which is really cool. So they've let me basically have free roam of the gym. It's There's no customers or anything there today. It's literally just me. Um, and I'm shooting with the one of the guys who I think either co-owns or something. He's basically one of the people in Block and he's called Max Oppenheim. Um, I'll leave him linked down below as well, but he wants to shoot some pictures of me at the same time So we're gonna have a fun afternoon of creativity Which is kind of why we bought the Canon lens today because we thought that that would be a really great Lens to shoot with one two three go <laughs> Try to look serious You promised me to do if there's anything haunting you You leave without saying where you're going yeah. or where to Yeah, go should I worry that you won't come back? Should I worry that you will forget? My sense is telling me I shouldn't worry and know the truth. Ooh, yeah. because I am currently about to get on a train to London to get my hair dyed and getting it put back to how it used to be kind of so that's really exciting and I can't wait for that which is what's up and really really seeing gross but I've got my laptop with me because I still need to edit the Jackals pictures so I'm basically panicking because the deadlines are like six hours and I haven't got it done yet but hopefully it should be okay and it should get done but I'm gonna pop into Nero and get a coffee and a cake because I'm freezing <laughs>
Right, I just thought I would show you some bits that arrived yesterday. It is currently Wednesday, but these arrived yesterday, so I thought I'd show you because I didn't get a chance to. Yeah, <laughs> so this is what arrived. The first thing is actually this bag, which is from Rare London. It's just a really nice kind of like cow print almost. Really, really love it. I love this chain detail. I know it's kind of like a Chloe dupe, but it's really cute and the bag size is perfect. Then from Silk Fred, we have this frill number, which is really hard to show you. So it's just like a frilly sleeved, frilly body top. Then I've got this grey jumper, which is like a split level one. I've hung it up really badly, so it doesn't look the most flattering. And then finally we have this little dress which is like a really gorgeous wrap front so I thought that was really nice for like travels and stuff. And then obviously we have the hair which I've not really talked about yet but I'm actually in love with it. I'm just not used to the blonde so I feel like it's going to take a while for me to get used to but I really like the fact that when the brown comes through more it's going to sort of gradient a bit better. But I really like the sort of caramelly tones and the really blondy tones. It doesn't look the best in my bedroom. I feel like I have to show you in natural daylight, but you'll probably see that tomorrow or something in the vlog. I'm just kind of obsessed. I really like it. So I've got my hair done. This is what it looks like. I am still in a dressing gown, so apologies. But it's really blonde at the end. And then I've got like caramel colors going into my roots and then my roots are natural. I honestly love it so much. I think it makes me look a bit paler but I really like the colour of it and the overall finish. Like, I really like this. Yeah, I just love it so much. But I really badly curled it myself this morning, so apologies for how shocking it looks. It's not the best, <laughs> not the best curling from me. However, um, when we got back, the car actually broke down. So Adrian is currently outside trying to talk to the guy because we've got to get him to come and look at the car. Um, basically, the car is being looked at right now and the engine was smoking when we got home. So I've been messaging my dad who seems to think that it could be like a head gasket or something. Um, and a quick search on Google said that that's gonna be about 300 pounds, including parts. So I've rung my insurance who are currently the ones that are looking at the car with Adrian because I'm no good, there's no point me going out there. But they're really useless, like my insurance is so bad. They basically turned around and said that they will send someone out to look at the car and tow it to a garage. Now, I might be naive here, but I thought that if you had an insurance company that they would help you find a garage and help you fix a fault with your car. But apparently that's not the case and I'm not entirely sure what is going on. So I'm just watching them out the window and hoping that the car's fixed because... God only knows what I'm gonna do if it's not. <laughs> it's basically been such a good week and this has just been like a minor setback. I mean, I'm getting rid of the car in four weeks time anyway, so I'm kind of torn between whether to fix it or not. And I think if it's any more than like 150 quid, I'm just gonna scrap it because it's already a category C because if you remember, it got written off um, last year because someone hit the back of the car. Some stupid girl was on her phone and she hit the back of my car and had to pay for it which is how I ended up going on bed sailors a second time, funnily enough. But yeah, so I think I'm just gonna scrap it if it doesn't get easily fixed. I'm really hoping this guy is gonna be able to do something because where I live, it's easy to get to places, but only if you've got a car. So like buses and stuff, it's a bit more hassle um, and it's quite expensive. So hopefully the car gets fixed because I'm stressed and... <laughs> I don't need this cost, but I love my hair and I just think it's so nice and blonde and cute and curly. And it makes my eyes look really green, which is cool. <laughs> oh, my poor car. Happy Friday. Adrian's grumpy. <laughs> Um, we're off to get some pliers because apparently it's my thermostat that's broken so Adrian knows how to fix that So we are we have the thermostat. We just need to get some pliers so we can get the thermostat thing off um, We're going to get that now and then we're going to try and shoot my Outfit of the day and I think I'm gonna try and get a shot of you. Cool. If you don't look miserable Because right now you don't look very happy <laughs> We've been really bad at vlogging this week though, so I apologize. Can you take this and we'll vlog and talk and drive? We have been very bad at vlogging. We've literally not vlogged anything. We've done silkies for Monday to Wednesday like we did last week and then it gets a bit boring. Maybe we need a few more silkies. 
Come and hide, hide.